What are the top five states that people are escaping to venture to the glorious state of Texas? What are they? Where are people leaving to move to Texas? And you know that they are. Texas is adding people by the second. If you look up the IRS data uh, that shows on people's tax returns where they used to live and where they now live, the data would tell us not all that surprising if you're from either of these two states, two states that the great state of California is a massive net loser to the great state of Texas. We're talking about billions and billions of dollars of adjusted gross income, meaning just people's income, leaving the state of Texas to, this, I mean, leaving the state of California to Texas. Almost $14 billion, 13.8-ish, of uh, personal income leaving California, moving to Texas uh, in the last year. That's crazy. Big time numbers. Now, California was the obvious one. We got four other major net losers to the state of Texas. And I'll be honest, as a real estate broker in Texas, number two was a little surprising, not terribly surprising, but more so than others on the list. And that is Illinois. Now, Chicago uh, is a major exporter of people right now. Lots of people leaving. And we know that we have clients moving here from Chicago. But it didn't seem quite as obvious to me as California because California is such a massive number one. You got Illinois losing almost $6 billion of uh, personal income to the state of Texas uh, in the last year. Number three is pretty obvious, Louisiana. It's a neighbor uh, not known for nearly quite as much job opportunity and uh, economic movement, although lots of improvement in Louisiana over the last 20, 30 years. But you've got uh, $5.31 billion coming out of Louisiana into Texas uh, over the last year. Now, again, that's almost always been a trend. You've got folks um, you know, growing up in Louisiana and leaving for bigger, better jobs. The oil and gas industry uh, has recently kind of resurged, but has been in a little bit of a lull. Uh, and so that is often the reason that a lot of folks will move to Louisiana. So those numbers might look a little bit different next year, but we're seeing a big move to Texas from Louisiana uh, in the last year. Now, number four, not surprising, but maybe would have thought it would have been higher on the list, New York. Folks from New York are moving all over the country, lots of them to Florida and Arizona. Texas is a big gainer from New York at around $4.4 billion dollars in personal income coming out of New York and into Texas. New York's an interesting one when you look at the data. A lot of people stay in the state of New York but leave the big cities, and that's true in almost every state in the country. So we might shoot some other videos and get into some of that data, but it's been really interesting to dig into the IRS data and see how people and their money are moving. Number five on the list, not surprising at all. Number four is New York. Number five is New Jersey at just shy of $3 billion of personal income. Again, AGI, adjusted gross income, coming out of the state of New Jersey into the state of Texas. Those are just the top five. Multiple billions of dollars in people in th that are represented in those people's income, leaving those five states, moving to Texas. That's California, Illinois, Louisiana, New York, and New Jersey. Now, we'll probably spend some time in some other videos on where folks are leaving Texas to go, but those numbers are much, much, much smaller. You're talking about millions, not billions, leaving the state. So obviously, as a whole, Texas is a massive gainer of people and their income and their tax dollars and their home buying dollars. As a real estate broker, that's where I'm paying attention. And then, of course, the taxes that come with them, all the economic activity that comes with them which again, if you're watching the video, you may have been around our channel for a while. We've got a lot of content on moving to Texas, specifically here in the Dallas-Fort Worth, Texas area. One of the largest gainers of people and income in the entire country and all of North America. So if you've got questions about that, let us know in the comments. We'll either shoot some more videos for you and maybe point you to some other videos here on the channel. A couple interesting observations here. Those dollars are typically chasing jobs and opportunities in Houston and Dallas and Austin. Lots of growth in markets like El Paso, Tyler, Texas. Definitely in the South, we're seeing really exciting things um, 
uh, like, you know, Elon Musk bringing rockets and, you know, visits to outer space from the South Texas region, uh, but also lots of higher education, healthcare, banking, uh, easy travel. Uh, Texas has a lot going on here. Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas, a lot going on. Lots of reasons to be attracted to the area. So if you're in the process of making one of those moves, let us know. We'd be happy to help. I'm a real estate broker. We have a great team here in the DFW area. Check out the rest of the channel, and I'll catch you on the next video. Have a good one.